Hey, and uh, welcome to the podcast for NickSmoot.com. I'm filming in black and white today, um, just because it's super bright behind me, and I think this might work better for uh, toning down the brightness of it all. But uh, just to let you know what this is, this is the tracking of Simple Mentoring Mythos Projects coming together, that nonprofit that's reconnecting parents and teenagers and making emphasis on the importance of that relationship. Uh, a couple things. One, I want to let you guys know, I know some of you have been catching up on this, but I just found this out too. Actually, down at Job on Sherman, if you come in here and you say, I'm here because of simple mentoring or simple referral, not only do we get a donation, but you also get a 10% discount. So, kind of a cool kickback. Um, but what I want to talk about today was something that I was reading in a report just recently, and it was a real interesting perspective that uh, one of the scientists stated. And the perspective was that um, parents who don't maintain a deep connection with their child or teenager uh, and don't allow that moral transfer to happen into the lives of their child, uh, they describe it actually as a form of child neglect, which is, I think, a very strong statement and very loaded because a lot of parents would never see themselves as neglecting their child and a lot of teenagers wouldn't see uh, see it as child neglect either if, um, if uh, there wasn't that connection and relationship there. Because a lot of teens, in all honesty, they prefer not having that deep bond occasionally because of the attitude that the culture's helped create inside of you. But uh, I just want to challenge you with that thought of realizing parents, if you're watching this, um, are you in some ways neglecting your child by not intentionally creating those moments? Teenagers, are you embracing this form of neglect because of your attitude and how culture has kind of shaped you to want that distance from your mom and dad and they're not important to you? But really, that's the place where you will form your primary understanding of morals and values. And then from there you'll take them as you're being developed and they're teaching and training you to start understanding a much, much, much bigger world. So uh, just a real cool thought today. Um, I guess what I'm trying to say is think through the whole idea of uh, child neglect and are you either becoming a victim of it or are you um, victimizing uh, unintentionally and not from a stance that you're some brutal, vicious person but that you're just not doing, you don't have the right things in the right place. You're not holding enough value on that connection between parent and teen. Have a good day, and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow.